What's going on everyone? Welcome to G-Ball Vision. Today I have an unboxing to do for you guys and we will go ahead and get started with this guy using the new Cuvist Vanish. This is a modern slip joint and guys it is excellent. 20, v, 20 CV blade steel, titanium handle, excellent execution. This one is the Urban EDC Supply Exclusive. And the last I looked, they were available there. The normal variants were uh, available other places. Uh, it's not a big guy. It is a smaller knife, but performs exceptional. Hollow grind, uh, just a great little fifth pocket user knife. So enough with that. I am stoked to get into this package right here. I knew from the minute that I saw these, I was definitely going to want one of these and I am ecstatic to get into this guy. The walk and talk on these is exceptional as well. So, Ooh, what is that? We got a Vosteed box. Now, Vosteed's come out with a couple newer models as of late. So which one is this? Which one is it? Can you guys guess? Leave it down in the comments. Do you think you know which one it is? Uh, I was very interested in this knife for several reasons and we will go ahead and explain those reasons here i love vostid's packaging you get a sleeve you get this tin which is great for storing various things then you open her up and you get a pouch guys you get a patch with Vosteed's logo on it. You get extra hardware, thumb studs. You get a COA card, a business card. You get stickers. Uh, they just seriously hook you up. You get a cleaning cloth. I mean, they are doing all of the right things. Does this come off here? It sure does, so you can use this wherever you uh, feel like so that is awesome nice zipper pouch I mean Vosteed's packaging is basically second to none especially in the price point for these guys they do an exceptional exceptional job so what we have here guys the Vosteed Gator now i opted for the warncliffe they made this in two separate models and they have an array of different versions within those two models you can get different colored micartas different blade finishes i mean they do an exceptional job with their packaging with their knives with their material choices and ultimately i wanted this guy because look how big this thing is that's what she said as well but look at that compared to the vanish for instance or look at it compared to the devo knives mash this thing is massive there it is against the the torn gap from Kaiser it is a big old boy so you got fragged micarta you got a all, almost deep carry clip there you got a lanyard hole you have oh that's one reason why I went with this one you have that copper pivot collar instead of brass which the green came with brass and once I saw the black came with the copper, uh, and sorry about that, and you get the, the worn cliff blade there with this one. This is the satin one, which is the one that I wanted. 
you are perfectly centered very well done so let's see how this guy flicks open Ooh. let's get that stuff out of the way look at that guys this thing is a beast look at that oh now that is a knife so you have a liner lock here now what do we got oh so you can put thumb studs in so they give you small thumb discs there or thumb studs but you can replace those with these which is the the larger thumb studs and I believe I heard you can remove it all together and they have like a chamfered hole there uh, I will probably put the studs in hard to use that fuller at least on the reverse flick the stud works good boy that flipper tab works amazing how about that front flipper ooh yes yep so you can do the rollover yep can you do the over the top deal maybe it's got a stout detent there it is gotta climb up a little bit it's got a pretty stout detent let's see there it is yeah you gotta be up there a little bit in order to get it over the top but you can get it over the top lock up is looking very good at like 30 percent or so so good lock up this is an awesome size guys this thing is a beast and i love love this blade shape uh the way they designed this whole thing you get like a little swedge there this is a very unique looking knife and blade shape let's uh we're seven minutes in let's take let's take those out and put the so it's gonna be t8 t8 to remove the studs there so yeah see look there you have a little chamfered hole I don't know I I don't think I like that I mean I could see where you'd want to do that but I'm a I'm, I mean I like thumb holes but I am a thumb stud guy for sure I mean I I like thumb holes but I really like thumb studs as well uh, and if I can have normal studs here that is what we're gonna do for sure wonder if I should have oh wait so those are just tighten them up by hand here so that's how easy it is it's gonna come with those smaller studs but taking them off is a breeze you just need yourself a t8 and you throw the big guys on and you're ready to rock Ooh, that is much better much better yes reverse flick is money thumb flick money Vosteed likes their multiple opening methods for sure uh where'd the other piece go did i lose it no it's right there so while we got these guys out let's check so Vosteed is still doing 
So you got T8 on the pivot, and then T6 on the body and pocket clip screws. I wish they would go to T8. I think they will eventually. Uh, I'm not sure why they, companies like Vosteed and the like, they love doing T6 for some reason. And you could just go T8 all the way around. Uh, but guys, for the money, I mean, this is ultimately very, very hard to beat. I mean, the packaging alone, the build quality of these, the material choice of these is phenomenal. I believe this one's coming in 14C. Right there. 14C, 28N. Gator, they keep the branding fairly minimal. I mean, they put Vosteed on the front, but it's very small, out of the way, uh, and they put the name of the knife on the back, but it's kind of small, out of the way. Steel marking, you know, that I can live with. At least they're not putting Vosteed in massive letters across the middle of the blade. Uh, and I appreciate that. I've always said, if you're going to put it on the, the, the knife on the show side, especially, put it very close to the scale and make it small. If anything, they got a cool emblem. I don't know why they don't just do the emblem up in the top right corner and be done. Bam. Uh, but that's just my opinion. Otherwise, this is a great great value uh and when i say great value 70 bucks guys and this thing is a freaking beast uh very very big here is the new cjrb echo which i'm sure a lot of guys have gotten uh it just towers over this guy uh 70 bucks frag micarta great build quality 14 c 28n multiple options as far as thumb studs small thumb studs thumb hole you get a little fuller front flipper rear flipper uh you get a a copper pivot collar in this case uh it's just amazing what Vosteed is doing. All the knives that I've gotten from Vosteed, which is quite a few now, the only issue that I have had was with their plunge lock. And they have since either A, went away from that, or B, they fixed it. Because they are still selling their button locks. And I'm assuming they fixed the plunge lock issues that they were having. But guys, uh, we will definitely be doing a full overview of this guy, full review in a separate video. Let's go ahead and cut something quick. Oh my goodness, guys. I'm not even... I could tell it was sharp. Uh, just by... I could feel it. I could feel how sharp it was. This is one of the sharpest factory edges that I've had in on a knife under a hundred dollars in a long time a long time that is that's a hollow grind I believe yeah that's a shallow hollow and guys that thing is slicey as all hell That is amazing. Oh. The Vosti Nightshade 
was my favorite Vostid so far. And this guy might overtake that. Now, I love the shill and kukri design of the Nightshade, but uh, there's just something about the way this one looks. Now, how it performs. <sighs> Dude, this thing is a banger right here. Uh, and if you're looking for a big Haas that has an amazing edge, blade steel, comfortable handle, neutral, uh, you can even choke up on this guy because you don't have a protruding flipper tab or anything like that. You have a nice soft spot here, uh, flat spot. Oh, this thing is awesome. This is everything and more that I hoped it would be. Uh, I am so stoked to get this guy on the channel. Lots more coming with the Vostid Gator. I hope you enjoyed this one, guys. If you're still here, I love y'all. Hit the thumbs up button. Leave me a comment down below. And if you're still here and you are not subscribed, what are you doing? Hit that subscribe button button right down